up what's up welcome to the channel it's your boy king cam the man himself welcome to the channel king cams tv this is my little series king cams t talk this is episode 13 13 you hear me one three episode 13 of king cams t talk let's get into it first of all sakiana sakiana you know some people are just now knowing that she got sex tapes out and she is very um you know, freaky, and she do this stuff, man, this has been years, that's how I kind of knew her through when she was on uh, Love and Hip Hop, through like, you know, the sex tape, and how she, you know, she a rapper too, but, you know, she got a new, new sex tape out, and she's, uh, you know, also on baddies, she's on baddies, so, you know, some people just, you know, blowing out of proportion, like, I'm like, this girl been doing it, some of y'all are late, don't get me wrong, what she doing is kind of extra, extra, you know, for her to have kids and stuff, but at the same time, man, you gotta, hey, Listen, if that's how they know her about and that's what she popular with doing, keep doing it, Sakiana. I support you now, you know what I'm saying? But, of course, people want to bring in kids. Come on, man. That ain't even none of your business. But um, next, Sexy Red. You know, I haven't talked about Sexy Red yet, but she's popping. You know, she's popping. Yes, yeah, she's got her own type of way of rapping and what she talks about, what she chooses to talk about when she raps. I like it. <clears throat> I like her. She's a uh, plus, you know, she's from, I'm from Arkansas. And she ain't um, too far from here um, in Arkansas. She don't. She's not from Arkansas, but you know she's not too far from Arkansas. Being from Missouri like that, uh, she's from Missouri. Now, with that being said, that's not Drake's baby. Come on now, that's not Drake's baby. Y'all, y'all wild. Um, just like Sakiana, she's got a sex tape out as well, and you know. At this point, it's like, you make a sex tape, you go viral, you know, kind of like that. But, I, hey, Sexy Red, hey, your music, I love it. Keep it going, girl. Keep it going, Sexy Red. Just, uh, you know, also, um, good luck. For, you know, you, you pregnant, you got a new baby, whatever, whatever. Um, do your thing. Just keep going. I just want to talk about Sexy Red. Next, you know, ASAP Rocky does date Rihanna, but I hate that people trying to, you know, his past is his past, you know. Of course, he was a bad boy. And, uh, you know, he got these court cases coming up, and they trying to say he's making Rihanna look bad. He ain't making Rihanna look like nothing. Rihanna, her own person. And, yes, that's her boyfriend and her baby daddy. But at the same time, he had his own life in the past. So, you know what I'm saying? He's just dealing with it right now. You know, Rihanna got kids bound. You know, she going to ride with him. So, y'all just chill. That's it. ASAP Rocky had a life, and he's doing better now. Period. You feel me? Period. Fence. I'm on the topic, and I've named Sakiana, and I've also named uh, Sexy Red. I might as well name Natalie Nunn. Natalie Nunn, OnlyFans, <clears throat> got leaked. But before it was even leaked, some of the videos on there was already out there, leaked. You know what I'm saying? So, I wasn't surprised by what I saw of the leaked videos. But turn on Natalie Nunn. Natalie Nunn been popping, man. She was popping when I was a teen. I'm 27 now. When I was a teen... She was already doing a thing on a Bad Girls Club, and now, you know, she's the like the face of uh, baddies or whatever. But, yeah, somebody leaked her uh, OnlyFans account, and, you know, hey, it's out there, and she don't really care about that. Like, come on, people already, you know, you got to think that she's a, she look at herself as a baddie, so, plus, she has a nice body. So, people, she in her eyes, she's like, man, I'm, I'm a baddie anyway, man, but. You know, deep down, you know, she don't care about who leaked her stuff. Nigga, it was already some videos leaked out with Nelly Nunn. Next, congratulations to N uh, Nelly and Ashanti on the new baby. He was, hey, and then they trying to say, you know, now on his pictures, he ain't smiling as hard. And they trying to say, he, uh, he found out she was pregnant, he stopped smiling. He, they just now announced that she's pregnant. They been knew she was pregnant. So during them times that he was smiling, he already knew. He just didn't tell the world that. People don't think. Nigga, he already knew she was pregnant. He was smiling. Y'all just looking at certain pictures that y'all want to pick out that he's not smiling. I'm happy for Nelly and Shanti, man. That's what's up, boy. That's what's up, my boy. You know, this is her first kid. He is. I'm not sure how many he got, but this is not Nelly's first kid. But this is her first kid. Congratulations to Nelly and Shanti. Next, I want to get on Angel Reese. You know, she's the basketball player um, from LSU, women's uh, basketball. 
Um, you know, she's a trash talker. That's how she got viral last uh, season. But, you know, one thing I would say is when that fame hits, I feel like you should always stay in character and remember what's your goal. Your goal is to, she want to go to the uh, WNBA. Don't get me wrong, she already got endorsements. She's getting her money. But you got to remember, you know, being the popular you are, you can do the littlest things and people will judge you. For being the famous person you are compared to somebody that's unknown. You got to watch what you do. So she just got to watch that. Um, they trying to say her GPA dropped, whatever. That was rumors. Uh, incident in the locker room. That probably was that. But come on now. GPA dropping. Come on. She's back playing now. She's back playing now and she's hooping. Angel Reese, just remember what the end game is, baby. But I'm a fan of you, Angel Reese. I don't blame you. Keep it up. For real. Keep it up, Angel Reese. I talk about these people a lot, but Jaden and, um, of course, Blueface, they had a performance and a fan threw something at them, um, threw something at really Blueface, but it was at them, you know, threw it on the stage. Um, this is how I see it. When a fan do that, of course, you know, if you're the artist, you want to beat them up. He got the girl on stage and got Jaden... To beat her up, but you know, security was there, you know, before it could really get out of hand. But this is my thing. Number one, if you're a fan, do not throw nothing at no artist on stage. Come on, you acting to get hurt. You lucky they didn't jump off stage and jumped it right then. But the way Blueface handled it, don't get me wrong, don't just leave it alone, Blueface, man. He ain't have to come here, come here, come here. Yeah, come on, come on. No, don't be scared now. Don't be scared. And why doing that? He's kind of you know, Jaden, you know, Jaden, y'all know Jaden, Jaden Blueface, man, they, man, they still together, you ask me, they just rocky, they rocky, you know, that's his day one, you know, since school days for him, that's his day one, one of his baby mamas, he, that's his, that's, hey, that's his bottom girl, if you, that's his bottom girl, but anyway, uh, got the girl on there, man, you know, trying to calm her down, making her seem like she don't need to be scared, got on the stage just to say, uh, tell Jaden to beat her up like that. Like I said, the girl, the fan deserved it. Don't throw nothing at no artist, man. Like I said, don't do that. But at the same time, with Blueface, Blueface, I, whatever. Come on now. That, that, that's, that's crazy. That's, that's, that's wild, man. That's wild. That's wild. I don't, but like I said, you know, people handle things different. I just know if, if a girl hit me, I can, I can definitely go probably say, Hey, baby mama, jump. You know what I'm saying? For real. Even though I'm not like that, though. I don't want neither of my baby mamas fighting and doing none of that. You know what I'm saying? I don't want them, my baby mamas uh, fighting people for me and nothing like that. I don't want them in trouble. But if if, if I had a, a problem with a girl, I, listen, like I said, one of my baby mamas, see, see, he, he, he got two baby mamas or, or more than that, really. But let's just say I got two baby mamas. One of them is real nice, but she can be feisty. The other one, she she can be nice, but she really tough, like like feisty, feisty, tough. And that's the one that I'd be like, hey, go get that. Go get that. But both of them, they nice people. I don't want them fighting nobody. I want them to be like, like y'all chill. We we don't do drama. But if, if just like Blueface did, that's what I'm saying. So, like, if, you know, girl threw something, and he like, babe, mama, handle that. Nigga, I, handle that. Or my sister or one, you hear me? Somebody coming. But anyways, I love y'all. Make sure y'all like, subscribe. This is episode 13. I'm the man. I'm out.